police. I, I, I wish I'd have started this video right earlier. You, I could have showed you fucking U.S. Marshal or whatever, whatever sheriff or some bullshit. They the fucking ticket police. That's all they do. Catch my fuck speed, no ride with no seatbelt. It's just punk shit. That's that's that's, that's their job. It's to literally get out here and get people's money. And we pay these motherfuckers. You know they say that they say that they gonna <laughs> they say they gonna put us in camps and put us in a police state and we already in a police state. And what the hell? What you call a hood? That's another name for a fucking camp. So I mean, all this shit they talk about, how they so afraid of? It's already here. You know? Anyway, that ain't even what I was talking about. Cause I just seen punk ass police over there with his fucking, you know, radar gun. But anyway, I have a golden opportunity here. So I was on the internet. I was watching uh, the Thirteen Sun the other day, and he's and he put up a link to a fucking a YouTube clip that they found. <clears throat> I gotta put this right, just in case I get some people who actually ain't heard this shit. This is crazy. They found. They they have found. Human DNA <laughs> in the fucking grocery store meat. What? Yeah, nigga. He said on his video, right? He say, you know, yo, you know, he talking about his time I got. He guessing, you know, twenty Walmart's. Next time I ain't got twenty. You know what I'm saying? Or let's just say ten or whatever. However many you think your city got. I know how many Dallas got. Uh, a thousand, goddamn it. But anyway. You know what I'm saying? Da, 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 that's probably five at minimum, minimum five hundred Walmart's a state. So fifty states, right? They probably all got Walmart's. Probably I wouldn't know, but probably, right? Where they getting all their meat from? And you say, well, I'm, you, sure, you sure they got a farm and shit? I never now. Now listen, this ain't my this ain't my thought. This ain't my original thought. I'm just relaying the message I got. You know, maybe I can. Maybe somebody that watch me that won't watch him, and then you can go watch him. Go watch him because he gonna tell you. To he know. I don't know. You see what I'm saying? I'm still guessing. I'm still trying to figure shit out. I know what I got to do. I'm going to do it. But anyway, where they getting their meat from? Okay? And that's just one chain. Think about it. Okay, we. I'm, I'm in Dallas. So think about Kroger's, a Tom Thumb, Albertsons, and then you got, and then if you 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 know Dallas, you got your Terry's and your Jerry, you know, all, the, all your little Hispanic stores. Where they getting all their meat from, right? Is that many motherfucking animals out here, even though they didn't chop down damn near everything. <laughs> and chop down damn near everything. Build a goddamn road. Look at that. Then they fucking around plant trees. <laughs> but anyway, I had never thought about it. I, I honestly never thought about it. I mean, I don't know. I just never thought about it. You just assume you getting fucking cow and chicken. And for you pork eaters, I never I never ate pork. I'm gonna take that back. I had bacon. I, I used to eat bacon. I used to eat hot link. I had I had a hot link um, phase for about five six years. <laughs> you know, my mom was Muslim, so I was raised not to eat pork. You know, so uh, that was just what that, that was in me anyway. And, and what I'm what I'm realizing that well, I ain't even get into that. But anyway, yeah, man, human DNA, human DNA. So here's my golden opportunity. Is what I realized. It, it's been maybe almost a week since I've ate any kind of meat. You know, I had I had been cut out beef probably about a month ago because you know what I've learned I've learned we gotta clean our body is our temple right I mean you know that so you gotta you know, treat your body right stop eating blood foods you know stop eating milk and all that bullshit you no know, shit you don't need shit, shit in the box and shit even though I ain't gonna I ain't gonna stunt I still I'm still eating shit out the box you know I had them all working on shell and cheese last night you know my stomach hurt today though. <laughs> And I think that's why. You know what I'm saying? So hey, but anyway, my goal tonight here it is. Like I realized I can watch this in a year and see how I was four days removed from eating eating meats. I, I should have did it day one, day two, day three. But like I say, I'm just not realizing this. I'm still learning this shit, so I ain't even. And that's kind of my problem. I'm not living in the now, so I'm starting to I'm starting to get it together. But regardless of what me, I ain't talking about. It. But uh, yeah, man. We gotta stop eating that shit. You know, hopefully, hopefully I get somebody. Uh, well, I know I'm gonna get somebody because I got to get. I, I, I talk, man. I fuck with people, man. I, and, and people that know me, I know a lot of people. You know, old or younger, it don't matter. I, I can relate. I know how. You know, I'm just one of them type of people. So, 
That's what I'm saying. I'm gonna get somebody. I already got my wife, so <laughs> I'm I'm good actually. Anybody else is plus ones. You dig? Cause my baby good. You know what I'm saying? My kids gonna be straight. And you know if any, if I could touch anybody else out here, like this morning I had the motherfuckers going at, at, at work. Ooh, I had them going. I love that shit. Uh, I don't know how they gonna treat me now, but you know I really don't care though. You know, my my new. <laughs> Man, I'm finna go in here with this, just, oh, she's so Christian, this woman in here. I'm finna go in here with her. I, I don't know. I know I'm, I'm, I try not to talk to the older people, because they kind of too set in their ways, you know what I'm saying? If you like 40 and you've been doing it, it's harder to get to you than it would be to, like, somebody my age, 20-something-year-old, 28-year-old, maybe 30-year-old, you know? Because we are more, we are more into the internet, so we can go get more information. We, I know we're more willing to get it from, you know, we that generation, I guess, whatever. So, I don't know, I'm going to have to go in here with these people and it's going to be hard to fight my tongue because it's always, you know, thank you, G. And I realize that no matter how you hitting, man, this one cat, he, he, he damn near ready to fight me. <laughs> no matter how much, what you hit him with, they got the phones in their pocket, but see, when you hit them with certain shit that they know will crush what they saying, Afraid to pick up that phone. It's crazy. I, I'm looking at this dude, and he mad. He, he mad. You know what I'm saying? He not mad at me, but he mad that I'm back here saying this shit about his Jesus. You know what I'm saying? And I see it, and he's just hurt. I'm looking at him like, damn, man. Like, he just in denial. You can tell. You can tell. His, and his points are just <sighs> irrelevant. You know, that's what the book say. Like, bro, who gave you the book? Who gave you the book? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Well, the internet got a lot of us. I mean, like, I told him, I'm, I'm watching people, like, like right now I'm talking to the camera, I'm watching people doing the same thing, but people who didn't been to school, and people who of age, and you know what I'm saying? People way smarter than me, way wiser than me. I'm listening to them, what they got to lie to me for. You see what I'm saying? And I go do my own now. And fuck all that. Anyway. And that's what I'm trying to, I'm just like, look, bro, just look it up. I try. I'm I'm rapid fire. I'm hitting with any little shit I didn't learn. Any little shit kind of kind of whatever they talk. Look it up. Just look it up, bro. I mean, you see what I'm saying? That's all you gotta do. It's out here. You can't trust the internet. Nah, uh, you can't. But you know, be analytical, man. Think about what you read and see if it makes sense. See if it resonates to you, or what or what they tell you resonate to you. And understand who they are. If you understand who they are, <laughs> you probably gonna feel like me. You can't listen to shit they say. Yeah, I'm gonna go back to work. Y'all take it easy.